to show you how to calibrate a Dexcom. This is mostly important when you've recently installed your Dexcom. I installed this one this morning and I need to make sure it's giving me accurate readings so that when I eat, I'm not getting too much or too little insulin. Hope you enjoy. So I'm actually a little lower than usual right now. I'm 78 and have been steady though, so it's not a huge deal. Um, but this is my first day wearing this Dexcom so there's no way to know if I'm actually 78. So we're going to do a calibration to check. So I've actually already done a video on how to check your blood sugar. So I'm not gonna go super in depth. I showed how to use three different lancets as well as my glucometer and ketone meter. And right now I'm going to use the Abbott Freestyle Lancet device. So to prep it, you just take the cap off Get your needle out, put it in, take the blue cap off, set that to the side, put the cap back on, dial it to the right number, and pull this back and release it. And now get a test strip out. And then put that back into your case and get your glucometer out. And now I'm going to take an alcohol swab and I'm going to clean my finger. I'm going to do my right middle finger. Right now, just set the alcohol swab aside and put your test strip in your glucometer and then it automatically turns on. And so, I don't know if I just got any germs on my finger, so I'm going to re clean my finger. And now I'm going to have my sister pinch my finger. And then you're just going to press this little button. And that's definitely enough blood. And then just hold the test strip up to your finger and wow. Um, my Dexcom says I'm at 80, but my glucometer says I'm at 97, so that's a good example of why you should calibrate to make sure your Dexcom is accurate. So, really quick, to um, take the needle out, again, you just rip the cap off and put the needle back on the cap and then just take this out and this will go in a sharps container. I don't have mine right here right now, but it can be like a Coke can or a detergent or an old milk carton. Yeah, and then you just put the cap back on and also your test strip, your um, wrapper for the alcohol swab and the alcohol swab all will go in the trash. So, as you can see, my Dexcom says I've gone up a little bit. That's fine, I can still calibrate it. As you might remember, I was at 97, according to my glucometer. If you don't remember that, you should probably get that checked out. Um, so, to calibrate it, you go to Settings, and right here, you press Calibrate, and then you just type in whatever number you were at, so 97, and then you press Save, and then confirm and hold and now i'm at 92 which is not exactly what my glucometer said but it's closer so i hope that you guys learned how to calibrate your dexcom and you are getting accurate readings now and i hope you enjoyed my video bye